swear. Oh, I forgot one more thing to the uh, Dollar Tree haul. And I had to go outside. I bought anything. Whatever. I, <laughs> I found this. Now, I don't know if anybody's ever used this. If you have, put a comment down in the comment box so I know what the deal is with it. But I've seen it on TV. And it also says mail-in bonus. Uh, but the problem I have with the picture, looks like she might have a little towel. Right there, it looks like she's touching this metal. And I'm thinking, if you're frying anything, the last thing you want to do is touch it with your bare hand. And, uh, I mean, if you can use it, it says for, I don't know if I'm going to say that right or not, a colander, colander, steaming vegetables and whatever all that old junk is. Uh -huh. But I said, even if it lasts a little bit, it's worth a try. This was a dollar. And usually you see this kind of stuff on TV for ten dollars what plus the shipping. So I get it. Here's the gosh. I'm gonna take it out. See what this stuff is. I mean, like I said before, you can get some good stuff on the inner um, at Dollar Tree. Do not use the small cooking pots. And it's got warnings. Very important. We, let me see what this is. It's not nothing really air free. Wow. It's got this on the back. It come in the box. Huh. And oh, this free chef's knife. You have to pay five ninety nine shipping and handling. If it was one of those new kind of ceramic knives, maybe, but I can't keep the ones I got sharp. This has got a lot of making pasta. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. I don't know. I'll just put mine in the in a big pot and boil it, and I'll pour maybe a teaspoon of oil in there to keep the spaghetti noodles from sticking. I'm actually open it. Burn hazard. Handle from sixteen. Blah blah blah. That come in the little basket. Opens up like that. Wow. Uh, what's this say? Thank you for your chef basket purchase. It says to wash it before uh, you use it, which I don't know. About what worries me is I mean, how, how long can you use it without it rusting? Is that? Well, let me try this. I'm just going to fold it up. Uh, like I said, if anybody's ever tried the... <laughs> the chef's basket. 12 in 1 kitchen tool. Leave me a comment below and let me know. Uh, because I, I like all this stuff. They had something on the TV. It was... Uh, it's going to sound gross. But it's called Urine Gone. It's in a little spray bottle for dogs that like to have little accidents. But that stuff works perfect. Um, but it's like ten dollars a bottle or something like that. I'm like, Ugh. but it really gets the smell out, especially if you're gonna have people over for the holidays. I mean, they know you got dogs or whatever. But uh, I'm sure you can use it with cats too. But it gets that smell out. That's just phew. I keep making these faces. <laughs> It's going to look so funny when I do the upload. Uh, but I just wanted to give you a hint. Somebody is getting this for Christmas. <laughs> no, 
No, if I get something like that, I, I wouldn't just give somebody a dollar gift. It's a good thing. It's regularly like nine, ten dollars. Probably, I don't know. But, uh, it's not bad. I mean, if somebody's trying to eat healthy and they need steamed vegetables, steamed pasta, this is a good thing. Plus, you can use it to rinse your veggies. And it says deep fry, but I... Where is that? I'm going to stick to my fry daddy. Anyway, <clears throat> trying to talk louder, but it's, kind of, it's not happening because I got allergies and cold right now, and I can't get my voice any louder than it is. <laughs> but y'all have a good day, and keep smiling.